Praise the Lord, praise the Lord, praise the Lord, praise the Lord. This is the day the Lord has made. We would rejoice and be glad in it. Welcome to Morning Glow. Welcome to another time in the presence of the Lord. Welcome to a beautiful day and an awesome day. A day to declare the glory of the Lord, the goodness of the Lord in the land of the living. We celebrate with everyone today for His goodness, for His grace, for His power in our lives. I celebrate you also, whoever you are, wherever you are around the world. May you be blessed. May you be highly favored. May you be lifted. May you be victorious. May the grace of Jesus Christ be awesome in your life. Father, today we bless your name. We thank you for life. We thank you for grace. Thank you for preservation. Thank you for keeping us. Thank you for your love so rich and tender. We bless you because of what you've done in our life, what you are doing, and what you will yet do. Bless us in today's morning glow. Let it be exceptional, unique, supernatural. Let your hand be stretched. Let your name be glorified. We praise you because you will exceed our prayer in Jesus' name. Amen, 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 amen. I'd like to welcome everyone who's joining us this morning. May you be blessed, may you be highly favored, may you be lifted beyond measure. Welcome all those who are on YouTube. The Lord bless you, the Ovu Benis. Welcome all those who are on, uh, on Facebook. The Lord bless you richly. We're still struggling a little bit with Instagram. It's kind of tough nowadays. It's not working with our software that puts every of the various social media platforms on one base but we are cracking it and we're sure you'll be blessed this morning we'll get it done we welcome everyone we praise the lord for you we pray that the lord will bless you the lord will uh, glorify his name in jesus name thank you for all your celebrations and thank you for all your prayers may you be blessed we'll just greet briefly this morning because uh, this morning we want to magnify the name of the lord and in the second part, I'll try to see if I can speak 71 blessings into your life in the name of Jesus. If the time permits, we'll first magnify the names of the Lord for his goodness, for his grace, for his power, for his amazing work in our lives. And then we'll not take the time to just speak those blessings. I believe there will be time. We'll just we don't do those long uh, exhortations. We just magnify the name of the Lord this morning. Wherever you join from, let us know. Pleasanton, California. Blessings on you. Abidjan in Ivory Coast. May you be blessed and out of favor today. Jesus' name. Jesus' precious name. Cairo, Kabakazedete. Mali, Janam, Brogosoli. We speak blessings on you. I'm told Instagram is now on, so if you know anyone who's an Insta person, let the yes well, well, uh, arise. 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 I can hear Pastor Matthew on Instagram myself too. So, join us everywhere. Kumasi, Ghana, the Lord bless you this morning. Uh, Essex, we're in Essex, let us know. Be blessed and highly favored. Sutton in sorry, blessings. Uh, Swinton, no, Swindon in the UK. God bless you richly, Jesus' name. Swiss Cottage, God bless you richly, Jesus' name. Liverpool, may you be blessed and highly favored. Uh, Pitsy in Essex, blessings. St. Elizabeth, Jamaica, blessings, blessings. Bedfordshire, may you be highly favored. May you be blessed beyond measure. In the name of Jesus, praise the Lord, praise the Lord, praise the Lord. Akiko Zolaba, Luanda in Angola, Dios te bensoy. Hey, Abosh, God bless you. Jesus' name, Slade Green. I think Slade Green is Southeast London. Let me know where it is again. Remind me, Slade Green. I think it's now Southeast London. Maryland, USA, God bless you richly. Oldham in the UK, blessings. Agbo, Delta, Nigeria, God bless you. Uh, Pukwase in Accra, Ghana, God bless you richly. 
Jesus name hallelujah renosha hikoto yaraba hikoto resha kotonu ben republic god bless you this morning in jesus name hallelujah 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 naboro keboro rendere kushala zamondi kobanagan in denmark the lord bless you richly this morning uh, slamanan in scotland god bless you richly jesus name warwickshire blessings pets word in kent blessings togo lume blessings on you jesus name barking in in sx or east london barking is on the borders blessings south africa east london south africa okay we have somebody from the other london today east london south africa god bless you richly ah uh, praise the lord ah uh, yeah 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 everyone's getting in london even lagos has a london called osaka london ah uh, yeah 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 Rosha. all right slade green is in erith in bexley heath which is southeast slash kent god bless you richly richly jesus name bagada nigeria blessings in jesus name praise the lord custom house east london blessings kicc togo god bless you richly this day jesus name praise the lord cools then in sorry may you be blessed may you be highly favored today may the blessings of the lord rest on you in the name of jesus may you be highly favored praise god praise god praise god today is very special it is special also because after praying new levels we're taking the time to magnify the name of jesus today we're worshiping our savior our lord our god our master shadrach in zambia god bless you richly nebo sukai kaba logien in france dieu vous bénisse praise the lord kukum lemle akra god bless you jesus name jesus name stand well in stains blessings zambia in the copper belt area may you be highly favored in the holy name of jesus kabai do shenari baka rote te kabande rosa bambredo Quirk in Ireland, God bless you richly this morning. Portsmouth in the UK, God bless you. Yanish uh, Kayemborosaya. Mozambique, Maputo in Mozambique. Dio Steven Soy, God bless you richly in Jesus' name. Dubai, in the United Arab Emirates, blessings on you. Tennessee, Nashville, Tennessee. The Lord bless you richly. Brookston Hill, be blessed in our favor. Charles Leroy in Belgium. God bless you richly in Jesus' name. E kavoro se ke ka ke koro sende alaba. Shangote do Nigeria. God bless you. Stratford is London. Bless us. Geneva in Switzerland. God bless you richly. One of those countries in, in, in Europe I still haven't gone in all these years of traveling across Europe. I've been traveling Europe since 1978. 45 years. Come well. God bless you richly this morning. Stratford, East London, blessings. We welcome everyone. We celebrate the goodness of our God this morning. Today is unique. Today is powerful. Today is awesome. I have to take today to just magnify the name of the Lord. I don't know about you. He has done so much for me. He has done so well for me. He has done awesomely for me. He has done marvelously for me. He has done gloriously for me. He has proven himself. He has shown his power. And I pray that this God who has done awesomely for me, he will bless you. He will he will touch you. He will save you. He will deliver you. He will 
do glorious things for you too. He will stretch his hand in your life. He will satisfy your mouth with good things. He would exceed your expectation. This morning I like to magnify Jesus. He is our Savior. The Bible makes us know that there is no other Savior but Him. For there is no other name given among all men whereby we may be saved by the name of Jesus. Father, we magnify you today because you are our Savior. Without you we are lost. We thank you for saving us. Thank you for the working of salvation in our life. To you be glory, to you be praise, to you be honor, to you be adoration. In the name of Jesus. He's our redeemer. We were lost. We were sold to the slave market of sin. You, Jesus, you came. You bought us with a price. For your word says, for ye are bought with a price. Therefore glorify God in your body. We thank you for our redemption. We thank you for saving us. For your word says, Job 19, 25. For I know that my redeemer liveth. And he will stand upon the earth in the last days. Thank you for redeeming us. Take the glory this morning. He is the bread of life. In the hunger that we have, that is more than physical bread, you satisfy us. You feed us until we want no more. You satisfy all our hunger in life. Take glory. Take praise. Take adoration. And Jesus said, I am the bread of life. He that cometh to me shall never hunger. John 6, 35. We have you. We're not hungry anymore for any other Savior, for any other God. You are our God. You will be our God forever and ever. We praise you today. We praise you forever. Thank you, Jesus. Be glorified. Be magnified. Be celebrated. Be honored. Be lifted. Kairesha. Maba baros kebiria la rota la dididira. He is our Lord. We magnify him because he's the Lord of our life. He's not just our Savior. He's our Lord. He, there's a difference between his salvation and his Lordship. Savior means he brought us out of sin. Lord means he's the master of our life. Jesus, you are the master of our life. Master in the morning. Master at noon. Master in the evening. Master over everything. John 21, 7. Therefore, that, that disciple whom Jesus loved said unto Peter, It is the Lord. You are the Lord. You are the master. You are the Adonai. The Hebrew word Adonai means the master. You are the one who is master of our life. Jesus can be savior and not master. You need to make him both. This morning we magnify you because you are the master of our life. Your yes is yes. Your no is no. Your word is final. Your desire is final. Your counsel is final. Your opinion is final. What you want is final. What you say is final. We give you glory today. We praise you today. We magnify you today. We celebrate you today. We elevate you today. Thank you. Thank you. Talibosha. Yidikemba. Renengelo. Nebi izoluba. Janiri yabarote. Renenga uzali taliraba. Be glorified. He is the creator. Thank you for creating us. Thank you for, for giving us life. Isaiah 40 verse 28. Has thou not known? Have you not heard? That the everlasting God. The Lord. The creator of the ends of the earth. He does not faint. Neither is he weary. There is no searching of his understanding. Ha! Your word says, Bereshith Barach Elohim. In the beginning, Elohim created out of nothing. We thank you for speaking. Katikuza, Mariketuza, Libikotodi, Shandelereba. Thank you for creating us. Thank you for making us out of clay and filling us with glory filling us with your presence filling us with your power filling us with your blessing thank you who will not serve a savior like this only a fool for the fool says there is no god we return the glory to you this morning jesus you are the son of the living god we magnify you matthew 16 16 thou art the christ 
the son of the living God, the embodiment of the Father. Take the praise today. Take the glory today. Take the honor today. Take the adoration today. We magnify you today. We celebrate you today. We elevate you today. We make great your name today. Thank you, Jesus. He is the only begotten of the Father. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten Son. Everything that is in the Father is in you, Jesus. Everything that the Father is, you are. And because you are, we're joined hairs with you. What belongs to the Father belongs to you, so it belongs to us. Favor belongs to us. Prosperity belongs to us. Blessings belongs to us. You have life. We have life. Because of you, we shall live. Reverend John 11, 25. I am the resurrection and life. Whosoever believes in me, though he were dead, yet he shall live. Because of you, we live. Because of you, we are. Because of you, we are alive. Because of you, we are victorious. Because of you, we are, we are blessed. We will never go down. We will never stay down. We will never be down. We will always be above to the glory of your name. Hallelujah. He is the beloved son. Beloved, loved by the father. Luke 9.35 And there came a voice out of the class saying, This is my beloved son in whom I am well pleased. We are not serving a God, a rejected God. We are not serving a demonic spirit. We will not bow our knees to any power, no matter what it gives. We only bow to Jesus, the Son of the living God, the Creator, the Powerful One. We will not seek power anywhere. We will not seek favor anywhere. We will not seek blessing anywhere. To whom shall we go? You have the word of life. So this morning we celebrate your greatness, your goodness, your power, your ability, your deliverance. Take the glory, our beloved Father. He is the Holy One of Israel. Hayaya Redoza. Let the counsel of the Holy One of Israel draw nigh and come that we may know it. Isaiah 5.19, you are the Holy One of Israel. There is none comparable to you. You are entirely pure, entirely holy. You cannot be corrupted. You cannot be, you cannot be bastardized. You are forever pure. Your eye cannot behold unrighteousness. We worship you today. We magnify you. We celebrate the greatness of the God we serve. The one who was qualified to come and die for us and the one who qualified to give us eternal life by his resurrection. For you are the Lamb of God that took away the sin of the world. We thank you because your conception was, was immaculate. So that you can be sinless. So that you can save us the sinful. We return the praise to you today. Be glorified. Be honored. Be lifted. Jesus name. Jesus name. He is a wonderful counselor. The mighty God, the everlasting Father, the Prince of Peace. Jesus, you are our wonderful counselor, mighty God, everlasting Father, Prince of Peace. Isaiah 9, 6. Jesus, you are wonderful. Your works are wonderful. Your stretched hand is wonderful. Your healing is wonderful. Your blessing is wonderful. Your work in our life is wonderful. Take the glory. You are the counselor in our dark seasons. Your voice counsels us. When we go through the valley of the shadow of death, your voice counsels us. You are the mighty God, mighty to save, mighty to deliver, mighty to heal, mighty to bless. Take the glory. You are the everlasting Father. Be glorified this morning. You are the Prince of Peace. Because of you, we have peace in the name of Jesus. Take the glory, take the honor, take the adoration, take the praise. He is the King of Kings. 
Hallelujah. You are the king of all kings. 1 Timothy 6, 15. Which in his time he shall show who is the blessed, the only potentate, the only potentate, the king of kings and the lord of lords. Every king cast their crowns at your feet. For their crowns are made of the dust of the earth. Thank you. Thank you for who you are to us. Thank you for what you've done for us. You are the head of your church. It's Ephesians 5.23. You are our head. We can only be as good as the head. If the head is bad, we are bad. If the head is good, we are good. Thank you for being our head. Thank you for being our director, our controller. Thank you for being the one directing our path for the path of a just man shines. Because you are ahead, you are the light that sees, you are the ear that hears, you are the mouth that speaks. Thank you for being in our life. He is the almighty God, almighty pantocrator in the Greek. Oh, yeah, the debosha, el elion in the Hebrew, which the Bible says, for there, but there is a spirit in man, and the inspiration of the almighty giveth him understanding. Job 32, verse 8. Thank you for being our almighty God. Thank you for being our almighty Savior. Thank you for being our almighty Father. Thank you for being the almighty one in our life. Mighty to save, mighty to deliver, mighty to heal, mighty to open door. You are mighty in every way. You are glorious in every way. Amazing in every way. You deserve the glory in every way. You deserve the praise in every way. We magnify you today in Jesus' name. He's the Alpha and Omega. <laughs> Revelation 1 verse 8. I am the Alpha and Omega. The beginning and the end. Alpha, Omega is actually the Greek alphabet. It isn't a spiritual word, but it's a description. Alpha for A. Omega for their Z. He is the A to Z. The Alpha, the Omega, the beginning, the ending, the author, the finisher. He is the beginningless beginning, the endless end. Oh, glory! Ha! We worship the God who does not end, and of his kingdom there shall be no end. That is what your word says. Your kingdom has no end. We shall reign with you forever and ever and ever. When we've been there 10,000 years, bright shining as the sun, we've no less days to sing God's praise than when we first began. Take the glory. Take the praise this morning. Be magnified. Savior, Lord, Master, Adonai, in Jesus' name. He is the Master. He is the Master. The Bible says, Matthew 23, 8, But be not ye called rabbi, for one is your master, even Christ, and all ye are brethren. Thank you for being the master of our life. The one who speaks and we cannot change his word. Take the glory. He's the king of the Jews. He's king of the Jews and the soldiers plated a crown of thorns. They put it on his head. They put, it on, they put on him a purple robe and said, Hail, king of the Jews. Hail, King of the Jews. They like it or not. You are King of Kings. You are King of the Jews. You are King of the Earth. You are King in several ways. You are King of our lives. Take the glory. All kings bow before you. The day shall come when all the emperors, all the kings, all the ones that have ever lived, Queen Victoria, Shaka Zulu, Alexander the Great, Solomon the Terrible, Ivan, Ivan the Terrible, Genghis Khan, uh, who shall we mention again? Uh, whoever, all of the great emperors of, of China, great emperors of Japan, great kings of Africa, they shall bow and say, you are Lord. For your word says, every knee shall bow, every tongue confess that Jesus Christ is Lord of things in heaven, 
of things under the earth. Oh, and things on earth. So, past, present, and future shall bow to our God. You are the high priest. The priest of our lives. You speak your word stands. We bless your name. Hebrews 3.1 Wherefore, holy brethren, partakers of the heavenly calling, consider the apostle and high priest of our profession, Christ Jesus. You are the high priest of my confession. When I speak, you take my word to the Father. So I say I am blessed. And you, my priest, you've taken it to the Father. I say I am healed. You, my priest, you take it to the Father. Oh! I do not have a fallible priest. I do not have a sinful priest. I do not have a priest that is tainted. I have a priest that is glorious, that is powerful, that is holy. I return the glory to you this morning. I praise you, my Father. I celebrate you, the King of all kings, the Lord of lords. In the name of Jesus, every knee shall bow to you. He is our Emmanuel. Emmanuel. Emmanuel in Hebrew means with us God. Hebrew and English are different. English you say El, God. Emmanuel, with us. Hebrew say Emmanuel, with us. El, God. You are with us in the morning. You are with us at noon. Hebrews 13, 5. I will never leave you nor forsake you. Thank you for the promise. Never leaving us. Never forsaking us. These 71 years, you never left me. You never forsook. These 51 years of being born again, you never left me. You never forsook. I praise you. I magnify you. I thank you. I praise you. I magnify you. I thank you. Take the glory. Take the praise. Take the honor. Take adoration. King of all kings. Lord of lords, Adonai, Savior, Master, King of kings, be glorified. He is our advocate, the one who argues our case before the Father. First John 2 verse 1, My little children, these things write I unto thee, that you sin not, and if any man sin, we have an advocate with the Father, Jesus Christ the righteous. We have an advocate, a barrister. A barrister who has capacity to stand before the judge of the earth and by the statutory book called the Bible. He is our advocate arguing our case. Jesus, you are too much. You are our advocate arguing for the forgiveness of our sin. You are also the payment. You are the sacrifice that was paid for our sin. You are the payer. You are the one who paid for our sin. You are the receiver. You are the one who received the payment. You are the payment. You are the sacrifice, you are the receiver, you are the forgiver. The mystery of your godliness. We give you glory, we give you praise. We honor your name. There is no God like you, no savior like our savior, no master like our master, no one like the one whom we know, whom we serve in Jesus' name. He's our mediator, the one who mediates, who comes between us and issues, who comes between us and the Father, who comes between us and situations and sorts out our life. Thank you, Jesus. Take the glory this morning. Take the honor this morning. And for this cause, he is the mediator of the New Testament. But that by means of death, for the redemption of the transgressions that were under the first testament, they which are called might receive the promise of eternal inheritance. Hebrews 9.15, thank you for being our mediator, for mediating between us and God and building the bridge to take us back home. We are forgiven, we are healed, we are delivered, we are set free. We give you praise. Hallelujah. Oh, glory to God. He is our good shepherd. John 10, 11, I am the good shepherd. The good she shepherd giveth his life for the sheep. Thank you for being our good shepherd. In a world full of wolves, demonic wolves, satanic wolves, wolves in human clothing. When Jesus said it, we thought he was only in church. It's in politics. There are wolves, political wolves. We, th we thought it is only in church. There are wolves in our places of work. There are wolves in our family. Thank you. They could not eat us. They could not destroy us. You kept us. We bless you. King of kings, Lord of lords, Adonai, Master, 
Savior, you lifted our head when the enemy thought he had beaten us down and we could never be raised. When the enemy thought he had packed us aside, you are our good shepherd. You are watching over us in the valley of the shadow of death. You are watching over us beside the still waters. You are watching over us to the green pastures. You are watching over us. We do not want. You are watching over us. Savior, Master, Lord, take the glory. Take the honor. Take the blessings. Take the adoration in the name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the holy name of Jesus. We celebrate you. Celebrate your goodness. Celebrate your faithfulness. Celebrate your awesomeness. Celebrate the God who was and is and is to come. To you be glory this morning. In Jesus' name. What a privilege to be able to speak into your life on my 71st birthday. Today I want to speak 71 blessings. But because of the brevity of time, I might not be able to do all 71. So you better connect with us on Monday when we continue on morning glow. Blessing number one. Proverbs 10, 22. The blessing of the Lord brings wealth and he adds no trouble to it. Please say amen powerfully wherever you are. May the blessing of the Lord, not the blessing of man, may the blessing of the Lord truly rest on your house. The one that adds no trouble, no money ritual, no bowing down to some demon, no satanic thing, nobody claiming the glory, no one saying, I made him, I made her. But the blessing of the Lord. Receive, 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 receive in the name of Jesus. Number two, for those who are always generous and lend freely, their children will be blessed. Psalm 37 verse 26. For those who are always generous and lend freely, their children will be blessed. I lay hand on you this morning and I prophesy on you. Not, on, not only you, your children will be blessed. Everyone that bears your name will be blessed. Everyone that carries your name genetically will be blessed. Everyone that comes of your father will be blessed. Everyone that comes of your father will be blessed. Everyone that comes of your father will be blessed. So shall it be in the name of Jesus. Number three. If you return to the Almighty, you will be blessed again. So remove evil from your house. Job 22 verse 23. This morning I speak into your life that as you return to the Almighty, as you serve the Almighty, you will be blessed again and again and again and again. I declare and decree shall not be a one-time blessing, a continuous blessing. That is your portion. A continuous favor. That is your portion. A continuous breakthrough. That is your portion. A continuous turnaround. That is your portion. Tadi tadi branosh gay tadi branas kiri anda branosh kiri. Radi sudu raba kiri tal dari raba rosaya. Hiri raba rosha. Hiri neri rivaka. Hiri marosong kitiya. Hiri nama taleri de brosh taya. Radu zubar ikitala branosha. Blessing upon blessing. The blessing that can. If you return to the Almighty, that is El Shaddai El Elyon. El Shaddai El Elyon. You will be blessed again and again and again. Job 22 verse 23. So may you be blessed again and again and again and again and again in the name of Jesus. Luke 11 28. Even more blessed are all who hear the word of God and put it into practice. I declare into your life today every word of God, every word of God, every counsel from heaven shall bless you, shall move you forward. Every prophetic word that has been spoken into your life shall become your reality, shall become your reality. Oh, I just saw doors swinging open. God will give you a special gift for me. As my birthday gift to you, God will open doors, as he does, as he does, as he does, as he does. Opening for some people. Then I see as if they brought fresh new fruit. 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 
fresh new fruit, fresh new fruit. They are bringing it to somebody. Get ready. It shall be. Your eyes will see it in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Number five. Help the unfortunate and you will be blessed. Although they cannot repay you, you will be repaid at the resurrection of the righteous. Luke 14, 14. Help the unfortunate and you will be blessed. Although they cannot repay you, you will be repaid at the resurrection of the righteous. I speak into your life today. The capacity to be a blessing. The capacity to touch the less fortunate. The capacity to, exp to bless. <laughs> The word Macarius means fortunate. A Macarius means to be unfortunate. This day I speak into your life. The capacity to be Macarius, fortunate, blessed, happy, progressive, going forward, shall rest upon you and you shall bless your generation. You will bless the poor. You will touch lives. You will bring hope to the hopeless, grace to the graceless, joy to those who lack it. Peace to those who lack it. Blessing to those who lack it. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Deuteronomy 15 verse 10. Blessing number 6. Give freely and spontaneously. Don't have a stingy heart. The way you handle matters like this triggers God. Your God's blessings in everything you do. All your work and ventures. God will bless everything you do. All your work and ventures. I love this. Deuteronomy 15.10. I speak into your life this day. I pray for you today. That everything you do. The blessing of the Lord will be upon it. It will be upon your work. It will be upon your ventures. It will be upon your work. It will be upon your ventures. It will be upon your work. It will be upon your ventures. Everything you venture in. Shall not die in your hand. Kakaba, Runa, Ibia, anyone who make themselves an enemy of your ventures. They've made themselves enemies of Jehovah. Jehovah will fight them. God will tackle them. Jehovah will fight them. God will tackle them. Jehovah will fight them. God will tackle them. In Jesus' name. In the name of Jesus. Exodus 23, verse 25, blessing number 7. Worship the Lord your God and his blessing will be on your food and water. I will take away sickness from among you. Today I speak into your life. On this my 71st birthday, I declare today that the Lord will bless your food. He will bless your water. Food will not choke you. Water will not be a problem to you. The money to have it, to buy it, will not be lacking in your life. Abundance will follow you in the name of Jesus. Increase on every side. Then God will take away sickness from you. You will live strong. You will be alive. You will live strong. You will be well. You will shock your generation. You will live longer than your, your four beers. You will be strong. And as your days, so shall your strength be. As your days, so shall your strength be. For the word says, I will take away sickness from among you. Wow. I will remove it. I prophesy into your life. I declare into your life today. You will live long. You will live strong. You will be a blessing. You will know God. In the name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. Blessing number eight. Do not repay evil with evil or insult with insult, but with blessing. Because of the, because to these you were called so that you may inherit a blessing. I declare into your life. In this season of your life, you will inherit blessing upon blessing. You will inherit blessing upon blessing. I declare to you, I speak into your life, based on the grace of God on my life, on this my birthday, that you will inherit favor upon favor, inherit blessing upon blessing, 
Somebody hearing me this morning, harvest will meet harvest. Harvest will meet another harvest. Before you finish one harvest, another harvest has come. Before you finish one harvest, another harvest has come. Before you finish one harvest, another harvest has come. Before you finish one harvest, another harvest has come. Before you finish one harvest, another harvest has come. Before you finish one harvest, another harvest has come. This will be your portion. In the name of Jesus. 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 Blessing number nine. Give generously to him and do so without a grudging heart. Then because of this, the Lord your God will bless you in all your work and in everything you put your hand to. Deuteronomy 15.10 The Lord your God will bless you in all your work and in everything you put your hand to. I bless your hands today. Your hands, this tool of of commerce, these tools with which you touch the world shall be blessed hands. Your hands shall not be cursed hands. Your hands shall not be withered hands. Your hands shall not be hands that are destroyed. If there is any negative, somebody have connected to your hands, we wash it, we cancel, we wash it, we cancel, we wash it, we cancel. Blessings rest on your hands. Favor rest on your hands. Blessings rest on your hands. Favor rest on your hands. Glory rest on your life. In the name of Jesus. So shall it be. Nika libaji. Ridoshi niangasi. Ritoloza. Mabarondi. Jalibro. This morning. Blessing number 10. Happy are those who respect the Lord and obey him. You will enjoy what you work for. And you will be blessed with good things. Psalm 128. Verse 1 and 2. You will enjoy what you work for. You will be blessed with good things. You will enjoy what you work for. You will be blessed with good things. I speak into your life today. Everything you have worked for. You will live to enjoy it. People have built and never slept in it. Jesus. Jesus. Young. One of my lawyers. Two of my lawyers have passed, matter of fact, between 2020 and 2023. One of my lawyers took me to see his house. All furnitures imported from various parts of the world, from Turkey. His wife had done a lot of work. He has bought a Rolls Royce and kept beside. Then COVID took him away. Boy. Boy. Just remembering now. So I prophesy to your own life. You better say amen with such power. Blessed is the man who preserves. Uh, uh, no, no, verse 10. Uh, tenth blessing. Happy are those who respect the Lord and obey him. You will enjoy what you work for. And you will be blessed with good things. You will enjoy what you worked for. And you will be blessed with good things. From all indication, the young man was also into real estate, was now about to really settle down and enjoy what he had worked for. And COVID just came and snatched his life. First hospital wasted time treating malaria while COVID was increasing. By the time they took him to another hospital, he was completely, totally, more than 80%. All swallowed up in COVID with his respiratory system collapsed. Baish Kabarosaya. I prophesy into your life, you will enjoy what you worked for. You will enjoy what you worked for. You will be blessed with good things. You will enjoy what you worked for. You will be blessed with good things. You will enjoy what you worked for. You will be blessed with good things. In the name of Jesus. Blessing number 11. Blessed is the man who, preserve, who, is, who, preserve, who perseveres under trials. Because when he has stood the test, he will receive the crown of life that God has promised to those who love him. When he has stood the test, James 1.12. Naye kiba, talibara. I've seen a few tests in life. And I've seen the goodness of the Lord. I declare and decree. 
The test will not destroy you. Some people went under. When the test of life came, you will be above. You will be winning. You will be victorious. You will stand out. Hell will be shamed. The devil will be shamed. The hand of the enemy will be shamed. The plans of the enemy will be shamed for you. Blessed is the man who perseveres under trial. Because when he has stood the test, he will, pre he will receive the crown of life. That God has promised to those who love him. I declare into your life today, you will receive the crowning of your work. The crown of life. You will receive favor. You will receive the promise of God. You will not fail. Anyone under any pressure, under any trial right now, I prophesy to you, you are coming up. You are rising. You are coming up. You are rising. You are coming up. You are rising. In Jesus' name. Blessing number 12, Job 36, 11. If they listen and obey God, then they will be blessed with prosperity throughout their lives. All their years will be pleasant as you obey God. As you listen to his counsel, as you hear the prophetic word, as you receive it and hold on to it, I speak into your life today. The prosperity of the Lord shall not leave your house. He says they shall, with, they shall be blessed with prosperity throughout their lives. Throughout your life, prosperity. Throughout your life, favor. Throughout your life, glory. All their years will be pleasant. Malaysia, Malaysia, Karaja, Mandiri, Kabizo, Nabaja. All their years will be pleasant. There will be no year that is a horrible year for you. Even the Queen of England, before she passed, she called one year Annos Horribilis. A horrible year for her. But not you. You are a child of covenant. You are a woman of covenant. You are a man of covenant. Every year shall be pleasant. 2023 shall be pleasant. Get your communion and get it ready. Your bread and wine, get it ready. It's a special morning. It's a special morning. God has arranged it. The Pastor Matthew 70 verse birthday will also fall on a Friday. Hallelujah. I declare again this blessing number 12. If they listen and obey God, then they will be blessed with prosperity throughout their lives. All their years will be pleasant. In Jesus' name. Blessing number 13. Job 5.17. Blessed is the man whom God corrects. So do not despise the discipline of the Almighty. In this season of your life. May you be blessed with divine correction, divine direction, divine correction, divine direction. You will not miss your way. You will not travel off course. You will not move off course. You will not go into the wrong business. You will not connect with the wrong people. You will not connect the wrong associates. You will not connect with the wrong relationships. Anyone who will take you down, God will remove them from your journey. Anyone who will reduce you, God will take them from your journey. Anyone who came to complicate your life, God will remove them from your journey. I speak blessings. I speak favor. I speak glory this morning. I speak the testimony of Jesus Christ in your life. May the Lord correct. May the Lord direct. May the Lord correct. May the Lord direct. May, the Lord direct. May you be blessed with the presence of God that corrects your journey, directs your journey. You will not miss eternal life. You will not miss your destiny. You will not miss your purpose. In Jesus' name. Blessing number 14. Psalm 1, verse 1. Blessed is the man who does not follow the advice of wicked people or take the path of sinners or join the company of mockers. Kaya tukuzibia. 
Radada, Hibarano, Hiprono, Hinketa, Renosha, every liar, every mocker, every wicked person assigned by hell to misdirect you, to mislead you, to misguide you. God will deal with them on your behalf. They will not be able to, they will not be able to misdirect anyone giving you counsel from hell. God will expose them. God will expose them. God will expose them. God will expose them. Anyone giving you counsel that will lead you into into misdirection, loss of favor, loss of blessing, loss of loss of your Christian life, we cancel their down their counsel. We silence their voice. We shut their mouth in the name of Jesus. Blessing number 15. Blessed is the man who makes the Lord his trust, who does not look to the proud, to those who turn aside to false gods. Blessed is the man who makes the Lord his trust. As you make the Lord your trust, I speak into your life today, you will not be falsely led. You will not miss your way. You will not miss direction. God himself will lead you. His purpose will stand. His counsel will stand. His will will be done. His purpose will stand. His will will be So shall it be. The Lord himself will be your trust, your guide, your leader, your father, your leader, your father, your guide. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Yeraboshayaya. Blessing number 16. Blessed are those who dwell in your house to worship. They are ever praising you. Psalm 84 verse 4. This is the father of blessings. Nothing will take you away from Jehovah. Nothing will take you away from the house of God. Nothing will take you away from the counsel of the Lord. Nothing will take you away from following God. Nothing will take you away from following Jehovah. Nothing will take you away from the God who has helped you, the God who has blessed you, the God who has upheld you, the God who has given you strength, the God who has given your life direction. Nothing will take your life away from him. Blessing number 17, Deuteronomy 15.10, give freely to the poor person. Do not wish that you didn't have to give. The Lord your God will bless your work and everything you touch. Hey, I love this. Blessing number 17, give freely to the poor person, including those who think they are taking advantage of you and using you. Do not wish that you didn't have to give, even when you know they are pretending. The Lord your God will bless your work and everything you do. Touch. Touch. I bless your hand. Everything you touch. If you sell sand, you will prosper. If you sell water, you will prosper. Everything you touch. Everything you touch, everything you touch, everything you touch will be blessed of the Lord. Kakeko, Sokaka, Shinedi, Tinetita, Ranoko, Zikiarede, everything you touch will be blessed of the Lord. In the name of Jesus. 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 Blessing number 19. If the place of Blessing number 18. Blessed is the man who trusts in you. Blessed is the man who trusts in you. Psalm 84 verse 12. As you trust in the Lord, you will not be put to shame. As you trust in the Lord, the doors will open for you. As you trust in the Lord, favor will rest on you. As you trust in the Lord, glory will rest on you. So shall it be. Jesus' name. Blessing number 19. If the place of worship is too far from your home for you to carry there the tithe of the produce that the Lord has blessed you with, then do this. Sell your produce. Take the money with you to the one place of worship. Deuteronomy 14, verse 24 to 25. I bless your hand today. The capacity to be blessed, to bring your tithe, to sow your offer, to sow your seed, shall rest upon you. There shall be never a season in your life when you didn't have to give, 
when you didn't have to tithe, when you didn't have to give, when you didn't have to tithe. I speak abundance, 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 grace, 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 blessing, 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 grace, grace, in Jesus' name. So, blessing number 21. Blessed are they who maintain justice, who constantly do what is right. Psalm 106 verse 3. I speak into your life this day. The blessing that will make you to do the just thing, the right thing. The blessing that will make you to touch lives, to touch people, to bring hope, hope to the hopeless. Put some land and a woman's quarter is on the land who had built with some wood. I said, and her husband, they have no home. No home. Just no home. Just built with some wood. And they're begging for their house in this broken wood put together to be there for some time. Her husband is a carpenter, doesn't get a job regularly. She once in a while uh, prepares what they call gari, you know, there's food from cassava, and not all the time. They, have, they just don't have. So I just told her, Madam, because they have to move you from this land, let me bless you. I shall pay for one year's rent. So we've just paid for a room and a sitting room. Man, it's like becoming kings. From living in a broken shack inside a bush that we haven't even put electricity in the area. I don't know how to cope. There could be reptiles at night. Now to a room and a sitting room. One whole year's rent paid. The capacity to continue to bless shall rest on your life. I did that for her. Which day did I do it? I think Tuesday. I didn't even remember anymore. May God cause you to put shelter over people. Giving home to the homeless. Clothing to those who are naked. In the name of Jesus, God will put testimony in your life, favor in your life. In the name of Jesus. Blessing, I think I jumped one. Blessing number 20. We've done 21, so we'll go to 20. Blessed are those who have learned to acclaim you, who walk in the light of your presence, O Lord. Psalm 89, verse 15. Blessed are those who have learned to acclaim you, who walk in the light of your presence, O Lord, Psalm 89, verse 15. So the rest of your journey, may you walk in the light of God. May you walk in the favor of God. May you walk in the blessing of God. May you walk in the grace of God. May you walk in the ability of God. May you walk in the power of God. For I have received of the Lord that which I also delivered unto you, that the Lord Jesus, the same night in which he was betrayed, took bread, and when he had broken it, he gave thanks said this is my body which is broken for you do this in remembrance of me lord bless this bread let everybody who eats experience a miracle in their body miracle of healing miracle of health miracle of progress miracle of favor miracle of testimony in jesus name after that he took the cup when he had supped and said this is the cup of the new testament as of now, as you do this, you do remember the Lord's death until he comes. Let him and examine himself, and so let him eat of the bread and drink of the cup. We drink today of the blood of Jesus. We drink for our health. We drink for our healing. We drink for our deliverance. In Jesus' name. Thank you, Jesus. So we have spoken 21 blessings into your life. Stay with me next Sunday, next Monday, on Monday, as I speak the remaining 50 blessings to make 71 blessings in commemoration of Pastor Matthew's 71 years on earth. To you be glory, O oh Jesus. To you be your grace. To you be all honor. I cannot forget that day when I was 20 years old and I gave my life to Jesus. And he's been so good to me. It's been my strength, my help. Praise God. Uh, sorry, my shirt is all sweaty. I did one hour on the treadmill. Still, we took a shower, but looks like the waters didn't cool my body. Still, if 
before I came to lead. So we give God all the glory this morning. We praise him for who he is, for his power in our life, for his grace in our life. We return all the praise to him this day. We return the adoration. Nebalo, Jonai, Kebizuma, Didi, Daro, Shandali, Kekoso, Rika, Tata, Tata, Seko, Yoraba, Jesus' name. Well, we're getting close to the week. We're in the weekend. <laughs> so join me 9 a.m. for live class. We have been teaching on the force, the force of confidence. It will bless you. It would really, really bless you because there are people all around you who will try to intimidate you. You know, some of them being as foolish as they come. And the Holy Spirit will never leave you ignorant. There's a side road to our estate and we're blessing the community by even going to walk on that side road because people coming into our estate will have to follow that side road. One guy whose house faces that side road. I don't know, some people just are opposers of good things. And he kept opposing my staff. Why are you people walking on this road without consulting me? First of all, you are not even the chief, the head of the area. Secondly, you are just, I mean, we've already gotten permission from the head of the area. Thirdly, we are spending Millions of Nigerian currency to just bless the community. Everybody is excited. When rain falls in that part, they can drive home. They walk inside the water. And now we're giving you a road and you're opposing. You cannot believe us. I was leading morning glow yesterday. I just suddenly heard the Lord say, end with warfare. And some of you will remember, I ended with warfare, Psalm 35. And just prayed warfare prayer. I get there. And they call my attention to the fact that this guy has gone to do some sacrifice in the corner of the road we are giving them. And so the workers who had to dig to put some electric poles for them on that side, they don't want to, they can't work. They said they put something here. I said, where is he? I just carried, I, I usually go with waters to continue to bless our estate. I just continue to bless. Oh, those who live in Macarius are going to be Macariously blessed. Just carried one and went and prayed over the rubbish the guy did and did the first work myself. No weapon formed against you will prosper. There are enemies of good things. They will not see you. The righteous shall be bold as a lion. That's what the scriptures say. So join us for the force of confidence on Sunday. 9 a.m. service. 11 a.m. You'll be blessed. The word will be so enriching. I'll share that message. You'll get to know what the message is. Don't miss it by any chance. Sunday night will also be absolutely awesome. You'll be great. Walton Stowe runs the big one. Don't miss Walton Stowe's service. It will be the big one, the great one, the awesome one, the blessed one. Praise God. Praise God. Praise God forevermore. Join us and be blessed. Join us and be blessed. The Lord bless you, keep you, make his face shine on you, give you peace. We did mention that we are going to bless people with gifts. We're going to be announcing those who have already invited 10 friends. No time today with all the blessings and the prophetic word. Uh, so if you have not uploaded all the number of people you have invited and who have shown, please do so. Just Go to this QR code. It will take you to the page to download their names. Even if you haven't made 10, put the number you've made. Uh, those who have actually connected either to Morning Glow Bible Study or have come to KRCC Prayer City Service or have connected to KRCC Prayer City Service. And we'll make efforts to bless probably the first 30 to quickly respond. The Lord bless you, keep you, make his face shine on you, give you peace. Bless your going out, bless your coming in. Make today an awesomely great day for you. As I celebrate my birthday, I also declare you celebrate yours and much more. You will live long, you will live strong. I was part of a service yesterday celebrating a great woman who lived 98 years. You will live even longer. 
you will live stronger and you will be in blessing to the glory of God. So shall it be. Kani do shuti yaba. Reno gaba ziki turunati kabiru taliririba ndiruzia. The Lord bless you richly. God bless you richly. Kedu bubenis. Diyo steben diga. Diyo steben soi. Bwa 